comes Tyrese Lewis for the Tim County Bulldogs. Passing right side to Hermias Fisser. He shoots it up from 16. It's good from down to the baseline. And the Bulldogs take a 4-0 lead. As the Indians come back the other way, and we got a whistle and a foul against the Bulldogs on a drive by Gilchrist. L.J. Sims inbounding with Indians yelling at his ear, and he throws it down to Blunt, and he's wide open, and Alex gets an easy layup. Very easy bucket for the Dogs, who lead 9-4. We have 5.30 to go in the opening quarter. A defensive breakdown by the Indians. Tosh Jones working off a screen. Tyrese Lewis goes over it, and Jones is dribbling left side, passing it into the corner. Page with the ball, guarded by Fisser, sends it right side to Gilchrist. He's driving, guarded by Mobley, takes it to the hole strong and scores. He's a handful. Not a big guy, but he can score, and he does off the dribble, and the Dogs lead 9-6. Five minutes and five seconds to go in the opening quarters. Fisser is dribbling the ball between the rings and passing to Mobley. He passed up the long three, dishes inside the blood. He makes a tough catch, missed the shot because it was blocked, but he got it back and scored. White blocked the first one. We got an Indian down on the court. Alex Blunt averaging about six per game. Already has four. And the Bulldogs lead 11-6 line. Anthony Jones guarded by Sims. Out top to White, guarded by Blunt. Shoots a 17-footer off the back of the glass and good. And now it's 11-10 with the Bulldogs leading. Sims handling the ball in the front court. He could do that against pressure, and in a one-on-one -on -one situation like that was. Jalen Mobley circles and shoots a three switch. Long bomb. Jalen hit four of those against the Indians last time. The Dogs lead by four. Two minutes and 37 seconds to go. In the opening quarter, Jones dribbling right side. Now he passes to Anthony Jones, and he drives, and he backs it up and in, working down the baseline. Bulldogs leading 14-12 as the Indians are coming back here late in the opening quarter. Fisser dribbling to the right side of the court, passing to Sims over on the right wing. He penetrates down to the three ball line and whips a pass intercepted by Gilchrist. He races to the line, to the lane, to the hoop, and scores a tying bucket at 14. And a rebound of the Indians, and they break back the other way quickly. Gilchrist driving to the hoop, missed the shot. And the rebound knocked to the floor, claimed by the Dogs. Here comes Tyrese Lewis with a three-on-three. Three, driving to the hoop, puts it up, off glass and good, shooting over Galen White. He now has five points in the game, and the Bulldogs are back on top by a deuce. It's 16-14, inside a minute to play in the opening quarters. Todd Jones dribbles and drives. Kicks it out of the left baseline, Gilchrist for three, and it's good. And the Indians take their first lead at 17-16. With 43 seconds to go in a quick opening quarter, L.J. Sims shoots a three, it's good. Hit a little iron on the backside, but dropped in, and the Dogs are up 19-17. And what is a fun game right now, Jones kicks it left wing. Lanier did want a long three over near the sideline, and the Indians might be going for the final shot. Anthony Jones with 22 seconds, dribbling the ball. Now the coach took a timeout. Very few stoppages of play. There's a drive. And a little biker drops in for Taj Jones with 11 seconds to go in the quarter. Game tied at 19. Bulldogs will get the final shot. Jalen Mobley might be the man to go. He stops, long three up in the air, off the iron, no good. That was Curry Rain. Dribbling left side, he draws a double team, kicks it off to Mobley. Three from the right wing is short. Raise the front of the iron, and that's it. Rebound of the Indians. Tyrese Lewis saves the ball, though, and a knock away. And Fisser puts up a shot in the lane and scores. And now it's 26-23, the Indians leading with 3.45 to go in the second quarter. Is Anthony Jones is dribbling down the left side of the court, guarded by O.J. Sims. They screen and roll, and the pass is knocked away by Alex Blunt. And here comes L.J. Sims, one on two. He's going to drive anyway, put up a shot, bouncing, and in and a foul. L.J. put up a tough shot of the lane in transition, and now he's going to shoot for a three-point play. He only scored six points against the Indians last time, including the game winner. He already has nine. He pulls the Bulldogs to within one, and he's shooting for the three-point play, and he drains it. So he has 10, and the Dogs have 26, and they're tied with Vidalia. 
with 3.27 to go in the second quarter in Vidalia. Penetration, but Jones kicks it off on the left wing to Gilchrist. Gilchrist is covered up by Fisher. He's playing real good defense. Now he drives into the lane, puts up a shot, and we got a foul. Ties Jones dribbling left to the lane to the hoop, puts up the back shot, and it drops. 29-28. Indians leading the ball game. Two minutes remaining in the second quarter. Fisser coming to the front court. Hermias penetrating against a double team. Had the ball swatted away, but he got it back, and he puts it up with the left hand and scores. He's a lefty, and that time being a left-hander helped him. Put the Bulldogs up 30-29. One-man pressure from Tyrese Lewis on the inbound. And here comes Page for Vidalia crossing the timeline. Minute 36 to go, Page penetrating, dishing into the corner. Penetration by Lanier, leans and puts up a banker, no good. They call a block against LJ Sim, who was trying to draw an offensive foul, but he did not get the call. Clinton Collins hustles up the ball for the Indians. Here comes Gilchrist, left side, three ball, and it is good. Todd Lanier hits it. And now the Indians lead 33-30. Myas Fisser with a minute crossing the timeline remaining here in the second quarter. Every time the dogs fall behind, they come back. Jalen Mobley lobs inside Blunt with a catch underneath and he lays it up and in. Alex with great position, scores his second bucket of the second quarter, his eighth point of the game. And the dogs are down by one, 33-32. Lanier who just hit the three, covered up by Jalen Mobley. Goes a bounce pass on the cut and Gilchrist scores the bucket. Well, that was a hard cut to the hoop and a really nice bounce pass. And the Indians are leading 35-32. 26 seconds to go in the second quarter. Bulldogs with the basketball. Fisser right side. Fisser takes it down to the baseline, passing to LJ Sims. 15 seconds to go in the second quarter. Bulldog down 35-32. Now 11 seconds to go as LJ's dribbling in the front court. Now he starts a dribble drive. Hops and shoots a 14-footer. Bouncing no good. Got his own rebound. Put it up with three seconds and it drops. And now the Indians will throw it up. Length of the court shot is no good and the Dogs will go into the locker room trailing their rival at Vidalia. 35-34. L.J. Sims crossing the stripe between the rings, stops his dribble and passes to Tyrese Lewis. He throws it to the high post to Blunt, right wing. Fisser, open three, it's good. Hermias with nine, I hope they're listening in Germany. It's short, Jalen Mobley got a handle of the ball, tapped it back to Sims, had it ripped away by the Indians, and here comes Jones driving to the hoop and he scores. And now the Indians lead 43-40 and a three-point lead is a big lead in this game. White working inside on the turnaround. Kicks it back. Jones is hot and he shoots a three in and out. Rebound to Blunt. Dogs down but three, four and a half to go third quarter. LJ Sims dribbling and driving and puts it up with the left hand and scores. A difficult shot from about seven feet. Has pulled the Bulldogs to within one and LJ has 14 points in the ball game. Here's Gilchrist right side guarded by Lewis, kicking it right side to White. He's wide open, 19-footer, too strong. Rebound to Jalen Mobley for the Dogs, who trail by a point. Jalen across the stripe, dribbling to the left side of the court, penetrating into the baseline area, passing it inside to Blunt. Turns, leans, turns again, shoots, and puts up a little short shot that trickled off the iron from six. Indians with the rebound. Jones right side, Lanier lost the ball, picked up by Fisser. He's got Mobley open, hits him with a long pass. Jalen drives, puts it up and in. Jalen with eight and the Bulldogs are back on top at 44-43. 3.33 to go in the third quarter. Page running the point for the Indians, dribbling off a screen set by White. He drives right of the lane and stops, kicks it off to White. He kicks it to Lanier, three-pointer in the air, way off the mark. Rebound to Tyrese Lewis, had it knocked away by Gilchrist but he'll be called for a foul. Now he throws it down to Alex Blunt. Alex turns left of the lane and passes to Tyrese Lewis. He turns and fires, hits the side of the glass. Rebound follow, put up and good by Mobley. Oh, penetration, Taj Jones takes it to the free throw line and passes to Lanier. He goes to the hoop and puts it up and in. 30 seconds to go, Indians by three. 49-46 here in the third quarter. 
Tyrese Lewis slows it down for the Timms County Bulldogs. Crosses the strike with 20 seconds to go in the period. Jalen Mobley is setting up on the left wing. Now running the baseline, he'll come to the right side of the court. 11 seconds to go. Sims catching the ball outside the three ball line with eight seconds to go. He drives, shoots it up over a double team, missed the shot. Rebound to Jalen Mobley, he puts it up. No call, and a shot was smushed, and that's gonna do it for the third quarter. As the Buddy Indians lead 49-46. Eight more minutes to go and a big rivalry game at Vidalia as we take a break on Y101. Eight, 7 9 to go in the game. Penetration by Gilchrist going to the hoop, puts it up off glass and iron. No good. Rebound to Jalen Mobley. Dogs with a chance to tie it or take the lead with a three. Lewis doing a good job handling the basketball. Passes to Jalen Mobley. Works off a screen. Dribbles to the right side of the court. Takes it over near his head coach, LeBerton Sam. Throws it down to Blunt. He backs in, puts him a banker. It rolls around and falls in. And the Dogs have tied the game at 50. Fisser coming to the right side of the court, passing Tyrese Lewis for three. Off the iron, rebound to Anthony Jones. Indians seem to be controlling the boards right now. At least the defensive glass. But A with the ball, leading 52-50. 5.23 to go. In the game, Todd Lanier guarded by Jalen Mobley. All these Bulldog starters have logged a lot of minutes. Taj Jones for three, it's good. Indians take the five-point lead, and we got a timeout of the court, and Vidalia takes it. 5-12 to play, Vidalia 55, Toombs County 50 as we break a Y101. That'll be a dog turnover, and now the Indians can take an eight-point lead and make it double digits. And you don't want that Taj Jones shoot the ball right now. Anthony Jones has it out to Taj. He'll try a long three in the air off the back of the rim. High rebound, fought for, played by Anthony Jones, puts it up in the air. And the Indians have quickly opened up a 10-point lead. 4.38 to go in the game. Wow, that happened quickly, didn't it? L.J. Sims into the front court. Dribbling right wing. Guarded by Todd Lanier. L.J. still handling the basketball. The five-second count is on, so he penetrates. Lost the dribble, but he was fouled. Sims to trigger down to the corner. Throws it. Hermias Fisser with the catch. He's guarded by Taj Jones. Hermias dribbling between the rings. The German stops and passes right side to L.J. Sims. The Tiff County transfer spins, shoots in the lane and scores on a tough shot. He has 16, a little above his average. And it's 60-52, Indians leading, 3.55 to go in the game. By day with the basketball, Tosh Jones goes to the hoop, puts it up, off glass and good. Bulldogs down by 10, 15 seconds to go. Gilcrest with the ball. And let's see if the Bulldogs will just let him dribble the clock out. Nine seconds to go. He's still dribbling right wing, six seconds. And he's going to dribble it out. Two, one, zero. And here come the Indian fans on the court. As Vidaya wins 69 to 60. And there they go. So it was a close game until the fourth quarter. And then the Bulldogs, because of the shooting of Taj Jones, he winds up with, what, 31 points in the contest. Leading score for the Dogs is L.J. Sims with 20. I got Jalen Mobley with 13, or Myers Fisser with 9, Alex Blunt with 10, and Tyrese Lewis with 8. 